hello hello welcome back to my channel this is nurse Laconda, and i'm here today to give you another video but stop what you're doing right now please and subscribe to this channel so i can keep giving you some information so right now i want to discuss the clipboard app so i was making this video to talk about the clipboard app because it was some videos about the clipboard app there was some videos about apps in general but um i'm gonna go over the pros and cons in the process of getting started with clipboard so make a long story short um me and my husband sat down and we was looking at our bills and we want to start getting out of debt so we said we was gonna do little things or jobs or whatever side jobs to get out of debt and um i started with dave ramsey's peace what is it peace Art. whatever his course is on dave ramsey financial peace university that's what it is um i started on that i'm only on the the third lesson so i'm going through that just to see how that works so um we can get out of debt we have some credit cards we need to pay off i was that person that swipe 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 well i'm still that person because i haven't changed yet that's what i'm trying to do right now i'm trying to change that right now so i signed up with the clipboard app um clipboard health care so the clipboard app is an app that if you are a healthcare professional i know they hire lpns cnas um RNs and I think they hire other disciplines too, but I'm not 100% for sure about the others. But I know they hire LPNs, CNAs, and RNs. So you download this app and you um, upload all your documents. Your uh, they're gonna ask for your nursing license or if you're a CNA or CNA certificate. They're gonna ask for your um, BLS. They're gonna ask for your TB test, or if you don't get TB, you get chest X-ray. You gotta upload your chest X-ray. Um, you gotta upload your state ID or driver's license. Um, what else? Your vaccine. They do a background check. And to me, I when I started with Clipboard, I had heard about other apps too, like uh, is it Nurse Key or Shift connect our in i heard a few other ones but when i went to their sites to me and it might have just been me it wasn't easy as clipboard to me clipboard was like the easiest it's like boom 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 a couple of days they cleared me and i was able to pick up a shift and the other ones i don't think they pay when you clock out for your shift um clipboard was attractive to me because when you clock out you get instantly you it's called instant pay you get instant pay so that's why I said let me try this one out and see how this goes so uh, first thing first I spoke to a nurse um, that I knew I saw a nurse that I knew out somewhere and she was telling me like yeah I just do the apps that's it I don't work for anybody I just I'm a 1099 independent contractor um, I don't work for anybody and I'm like, oh, okay. I said, how's that going? She was like, well, I like you. You just got to keep up, you know, because you got to pay those taxes back at the end of the year. And then she was telling me like, um, be careful on, um, how much the facility pay. Cause she said sometimes they pay more, but you might get to that facility and not like it. She said, so don't go by the money. And so she was just telling me some of the facilities cause we, we're in Chicago so she was just telling me some of the facilities that she's worked that she's like she was telling me the ones that don't go to because of you know different issues or whatever so i was like okay cool so she gave me a good insight so i went on ahead uploaded all my documents and waited for them to approve me once they approved me i picked up a shift um so you go to it's so easy like when you go on the app you literally go to the date and the date and it say a.m p.m or nights and you click the shift you want and they they offer eight hour shifts they offer seven and a half hour shifts they offer 12 hour shifts i only have picked eight hour shifts i haven't did a 12 hour shift yet i was a little nervous about doing that but um so far so good so i'm gonna go over the pros of doing clipboard and i'm gonna go over the cons so <clears throat> the pro of course is that when you clock out and upload that timesheet, 
you can get paid as soon as you do it um that's the pro pro is you make your own schedule you work when you want to work when you click that day when you go in that app and pick the day you want that's all that's the good thing you make your own choice when you want to work okay that's the flexibility of it and you can work when you need the money you can work when you just you need you got to do something you try to plan something that's the good thing about it um the process another pro the process like i said was very easy and quick um they're also in multiple states i don't know if they're in all 50 states but i think they're in a lot of states um yeah because i saw somebody was in atlanta made a video about it and um i'm in illinois so they're in multiple states um and you can communicate directly through the app um with the, the company or job you're going to i like that because um like if you're going to a facility you can go through the app and, and talk to the person at the facility and ask them questions or whatever and they also do the same they'll 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 go to me through the app and it pops up on your phone like you got a message from clipboard or whatever and it'll say oh could you come in early i've gotten that twice um when i picked up a 11 p.m to 7 a.m shift they wanted me to come in at 7 and i couldn't do it though but they they still let me come in at 11 so they have messaged me and asked me could I come in early um and then I've messaged them and asked them certain things it was like an issue with the time on when uh the time change daylight seven times change and so I went on the, um, the app and, and sent the message to the facility. Also, if you got any problems with, you know, with clipboard, you know, the process or whatever going on with, you can go on to the chat. Um, calling them, you'll be on hold a little long. But if you go to the chat, first you talk to like a bot. And then if the bot don't answer your or get the problem solved, then they'll connect you with a live person through the chat. And I have, I have had to talk to somebody twice. Um, once because one time i forgot to clock in oh and please don't do that now i put a time on my phone to make sure i clock in my phone the alarm on my phone to clock in i mean because one day i forgot so i couldn't get instant pay that day because um i didn't clock in but the the thing about it is even though you clock in and you clock out on your app you still have to upload a timesheet so once i uploaded the timesheet and they verified it they did release my funds in 48 hours so that still was good but i didn't get paid that next morning but it was cool i just you know i like the fact that you work you get paid right away but it was my fault because when i got there it was kind of like some stuff going on about what floors or whatever so i literally forgot and then when i remembered it was like midnight i'm like oh and it wouldn't let me it would not let me clock in at midnight and they adjust the time so um, I'm sorry I just uploaded my time sheet at the end of the shift and then they verified it and released my funds in 48 hours so um it's different pay rates uh, it really depends on what state you in so like in Illinois I saw um, and I picked um, shifts that pay some paid uh, the, the range was 48 to 65 dollars that I've saw so far on the app um 48 to 65 so i saw 48 i saw 52 i saw 60 65 so it just depends on the need and the facility so those are some of the pros and it might be more pros but i just can't think of them right now but some of the cons let me tell you the cons so the con is is that as an rn i never worked long term care as a nurse a floor nurse now i worked long-term care as a mat nurse manager but i never ever was like a person that worked the cart so now if a, if like one day we had a real bad storm and all a lot of nurses called off so yeah of course i had to get out there and help but we all kind of chipped in and, and got the job done so i don't consider myself a long-term care nurse because i always worked in the hospital uh for mostly my whole rn career Career. so um the jobs that i've did on the clipboard app has been all long-term care but i gotta say it wasn't bad for me not to you know for me to be a hospital nurse and not really a long-term care nurse it wasn't bad so um the cons though is that you don't know what you're walking into some floors have one nurse at night some have two and depending on the patient ratio now clipboard has like a racial amount uh 
amount that the RNs or the nurses or whatever can go up to and you know when they get to that max they can't take any more patients so you would have to talk to clipboard if you ever in that situation um now if like I said the other con is if you don't clock in you forget you might not get instant pay so please put a little alarm on your phone make sure you clock in that's what I've been doing since I did that that day I just put the alarm on the phone and um so and then another con can be if you don't know the charting system so by me being a manager at a long-term care facility in Chicago for a couple of years um, we had a certain charting system and a lot of the long-term care facilities use that charting system still to this day so when I went to do the job that was the same system that I already knew so that was a plus for me because I knew it when I was a nurse manager so um, and I and I say this too when you do if this is your first time starting off at with the clipboard app or any app at that uh, at any app these nursing apps make sure you go early the first time you ever work because I went early that day because I needed a login like they're gonna have to give you a login like a username then you have to set up a password and everything that stuff take time especially if you work in night shift you gotta call somebody late you know they might be asleep they might be in bed they might be down for the night but I had yeah I had to call the young lady who handles that she was at home like and it was late and she was kind of like tired but she did help me and get me in the system it took like maybe 15 minutes or so um, so I would say go in a little early just to get that stuff out the way so you won't get behind um, So that was another con just not knowing the charting system going in late on your first day you ever start and don't um, Have a username and pass and set up and have a password don't have a username and password could be a con too um, You also can get canceled so um, I've been going hard with the app doing a couple of nights a week and um they did cancel me the other day. I'm like, dang. And then after they canceled me the next day, they I didn't pick up that day. They sent me a message like, well, could you come in this day? And I'm like, I couldn't come in that day. But um, you can get canceled. I only got canceled once um, so far. But um, and then another thing, too, like um, I signed up for one facility, but they have a sister facility. They they uh, they messaged me and said they didn't need me for that facility, but they needed me for their sister facility. So I ended up going to the sister facility. That was cool as well. So um, that was another thing that happened, and that was good. Oh, so of course another con is too that they don't take out taxes because you are a 1099 independent contractor. You have to pay your taxes at the end of the year. That could be a con if you don't keep up with it but the good thing about the clipboard app in it's a it's a app it's a section in the app that lets you know like how much you've made and all and all that for taxes so that's a good thing you'll have that to go by um, <laughs> the thing is when I first worked the day so when I first worked that day I didn't know I needed timesheets I'm like the girl's like do you got a timesheet uh, I guess the facility has them too but I don't know it was late and that girl didn't seem like she knew about it so um one of the employees that was also from clipboard worked that day too and she gave me a few of them and then i made copies so um but she told me that you could go on clipboard website and print them out so if you're first starting you don't know you definitely need a time sheet you you're gonna clock in on your phone but you need those clipboard time sheets she said it's on their website you can print them out i luckily got them from there from her and made copies so i'm good now because in order to get paid you have to upload after your shift is over and you clock out you have to take a picture of that timesheet because somebody has to sign that you worked and it could be a nurse on the floor supervisor whatever and you take a picture of it and upload it to clipboard app and then they will release your money but hold on so i did all that and i'm like okay i looked at my account i'm like where's my money and so little behold my money was in this it's called snipe I'm, I'm almost positive called snipe and you go in the clipboard app you go into payroll and then it'll it'll take you to snipe and then you could in that section of the app you can say if you want your money as soon as you um release your uh time sheet it could go straight in your account or you can go in there and release it yourself i picked to go in there and release it myself um just in case you know I don't want it in that account or I want to do something else I don't know but I just 
just pick the releasing myself but you can do either or you can have it released soon as you um you do your insta pay upload your timesheet or you could go in the app and say okay i'm releasing it and then it'll go to your account you could have it going to your debit card you can have it going to your checking account whichever way you want to do it you get that money the same day so um so far i don't have any complaints um the the places that i've went to have been okay they've been cool with me it is a change from my you know from me doing acute care but um hey when i see that that good old money flowing as soon as i get you know get done i was like okay i could do this you know and so um i'm i'm gonna give it an a1 i'm gonna give I, I really like it. I don't have any complaints thus far. Now, I don't know down the line, but so far it's been pretty good. Um, stay tuned for more videos because I'm doing a transition in my career. I will be doing something else and I will be leaving another place, but I'll be making a video about that soon too. But as far as a uh, clipboard, um, so far I like it um, to me. The pros outweigh the cons and um, you know but just make sure when you go just a little tip if you do clipboard and you start working or whatever make sure you bring water make sure you bring um, you know your little stuff like you know the facility might have stuff but I brought my own bleach wipes it was in my book bag I brought um, you know my own blood pressure stuff and um, I brought uh, my own scissors stuff like that i just brought that the facility did have that stuff but i just brought my own stuff and you know let me show you how you stethoscope and all that good stuff um only thing about the patient care at night with long-term care of course you got blood sugars and you have g-tubes but the good thing about it because those pumps you can just go in there if it's time for a flush you just hit the flush on the pumps now i don't know how all the pumps are but for the facilities that i've went to so far you just push a button on those pumps that say flush the flush is set in there and it flushes the uh, the patient you don't got to do anything just make sure they head the bed is elevated and i like that so that you know that helped out but other than that it was all good to me and I you know and I will keep doing it you know as long as I can to uh, pay off you know the debt that I'm working on so I'll be making a new video because actually clipboard is something I'm gonna be doing in between something because I'm I'm not gonna be doing it for a while now because I'm doing another endeavor starting com coming up so I'll make a video about that after I do it and and give updates but please uh, like this channel subscribe to this channel like this video i mean and subscribe to this channel and share this video somebody else might want to know about clipboard if you have any questions please leave them in the comments section and i will be back Keep on walking straight.